in ana wach in nahwaralta wach in khalakin bewi ana khachel for as long as i can remember trees have coaxed me to their branches in the same way light tempts a moth near on a dark night my mommy told me that even before i learned to walk i pushed away from the safety of her arms and crawled alone to a great encino tree near a thatched roof home i sat beneath the tree and gazed up at the branches as if their leaves had called to me as i grew i pulled myself up among those same branches and stared even higher hearing new voices my mommy told me gabriela when you climb a tree it takes you closer to heaven and i believed her it was not long before the entire canton called me tree girl la ali re hayub we were a family one that provided for each other one that trusted each other one that was at peace I think my youth allowed me to ignore the possibility of war, although I too had seen more military trucks passing by me on the highway as I walked to school each day down in the valley. Patrols of soldiers had begun crossing the hillsides, sometimes stopping in our canton to ask questions. Guerrillas without uniforms also questioned us. Both sides used the same words. You must not help the enemy, they warned us. If you do, then you are also the enemy. But tree girls are very special. They are not cowards. They don't blame themselves for things they can't control. Tree girls know that when they climb they might fall. But they know also that climbing lets them visit the birds. They're strong enough to face the bad in life. in order to know the good they're strong enough to face pain so they can also know hope they're willing to risk the ugliness of life in return for the beauty they find tree girls find beauty when no one else dares